NTW to the rescue. Yes. Yes. Now we just got to figure out where to get put on. You guys got any toys? We need some toys. <laughs> I don't know where the dock is. I guess I'll just pull in yeah, and we'll find out. Okay, so we're here at NTW. Yeah, we're Tell us what's right. going on here now. Oh, we're we're going to stack them and pack them. Jeez. Holy crap, will it fit? Will it fit? Please, is this how you get a please. haul four tire? Luckily, they're not very big. I know. Look, two so what fit. size tires are these? Uh, 205 70 14s. 205. All right. So you got one here. Yeah, and then... so, so it looks like you don't have to have one on your lap. Okay, you have some bungee see. cords that we can strap yeah, a couple to the roof? It's like a rally car, right? Just put it on the roof. Here, let's see if this will fit in here. Please, please, please fit. You got please fit, fit, please fit. Oh my God. Yes! Yes! Oh yeah, that looks proper going down the road. That will work, okay? Now we gotta get one and more. You need to refix your dealer plate a little oh, bit, Oh yeah, right? yeah, yeah. All right. Oh man. See? I told you we could do it. <laughs> you never doubted me, right? Not for a second, right? <laughs> well, it's a Monday, so. <laughs> oh, crap. Don't mess up that velour. It looks like somebody's got a case of the Mondays. Uh, yeah, that rear view mirror is going to work really well. Oh, jeez. Okay, I got to get something to put the seat in your head, man. I don't want black marks on my upholstery. Oh. Well. <laughs> Sometimes friendship just leaves a crazy crowd. Sometimes it ain't worth it, is it? <laughs> no. All right, we're stopped here at Redco Tire, getting new tires put on. <laughs> Check it out. What do you think, Brian? <laughs> I like it. <laughs> It's got brand new fuel pump, brand new fuel filter. Yeah, yeah, because it was probably locked up there. Yeah. Little, little uh, doink in the quarter that's there. That's gonna be easy. Yeah, that's a pretty easy pop out and Dude, body work. It, Dude, yeah, no, I, I didn't know. You got, that you got those though. Yeah, I don't remember that. The picture. I don't remember. Huh. I wonder if they did that at the lot. I didn't even notice it. Hey, no wonder they had it backed up to a snowbank, huh? There you go. <laughs> I don't remember that, but anyway, no, uh, it's probably there. But uh, getting some new shoes on and back out on the road. All right, Brian has taken the wheel, Woo! the giant uh, lorry wheel. <laughs> this thing, seriously, it's like I'm driving the MS Bounty. <laughs> it's crazy. Oh my god! Like, I feel like it should have like deals on here, like Captain Hook, you know. The throttle should be a big toggle. <laughs> I've given all I got. <laughs> so Brian's taking the wheel. So I'm gonna have some fun and kind of snoop through the car. I love to see like what is uh, in cars and find out a little bit about the previous we owner of the had car. Time to, like, no, no, this has been kind of crazy because we did get the armrest down. Yes, the, oh, yeah. that's how far we got yeah. with the armrest oh, down. I know. So comfortable, yeah, and we could even share, you know, yeah. kind of like Lady in the Tramp here with the armrest, you know. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so you know, going through the mountains on the old tires was, you know, we were kind of focusing, you know, on the on the on the road ahead. But we got new tires mounted up now. Right. That was an adventure, wasn't it? Oh, that God. was no authorized Mercedes service center for by any means. But they you know, pulled out three jacks. <laughs> that was three jacks. That was awesome. There was no, you know. Uh, it was a tripod. Yes. <laughs> but you know, they put new valve stems in, torqued the, the wheels and they put them on and yeah. did a good job. So yeah. so happy with that. And uh, so now we're rolling down the road. We checked the oil, checked the belts, checked all the fluids, coolant, everything is really nice. Yeah. And so I'm pretty well, I shouldn't <laughs> optimistic <laughs> about our uh, oh, our chances yeah. here, but um but now we got new rubber, okay? Yeah. So now, I mean, it, it's hammer down. It is hammer, hammer down. It's hammer down. It's hammer time. As soon as we clear the city, yeah. Lewis, it's like in Gumball it's, Rally. It's like Lewis, it's hammer time. That's right. <laughs> what is behind us that doesn't not matter. Yes, that's right. That's right. So I want to see like uh, what's in the uh, glove box here. Yeah. What is in the glove box? Oh, cool. It's full of stuff. Yes. Oh, my gosh. See, music is my thing. Somebody moved out of this thing quick. Harry Belafonte. 
<laughs> Folk no standards. Way. Oh my gosh. Are and you, you, you know the funny thing is, is the it original. Doesn't even have a, yeah, it doesn't. But the original radio is in the trunk. Uh, and okay. I'm putting the original radio back in this car. Oh my well, that I way love, you can play Harry. Exactly. Just just for Harry. So just what what are the Harry. tracks on here? Let's see here. Oh, oh I can't. I can't. I gotta zoom in here. Okay, here we go. Dale, I told you. I told you. Good, you're buying lunch. Dale, Dale, daylight come and we wanna go home. Oh man, I cannot wait to hear that. What else is in here? Old intro. Oh, hey, I won't show that. But there's there's the previous, the previous owner right there. there previous yeah. owner. We're gonna stalk him. Yeah. <laughs> All the owners manuals. You gotta find out the real like the story of this yes. car. All the owners manuals are in the trunk. So that's cool. What is what is that pouch? Oh my gosh, I think I see what this oh. Oh my goodness. Brian. No way. Oh, uh, oh, this thing's heavy. It's an original. Oh, I gotta feel the, that. It's heavy. Oh my gosh. Dude, that's like a watch. I mean that That is real cool, really cool. Oh my gosh. That's pretty neat. If you were a good friend of mine, I'd give it to you for coming along. <laughs> <laughs> but look. I think it actually goes in here. It has its own pouch. Yep. Oh I thought that gosh. was a little tiny pistol. <laughs> <laughs> Shooting the pistoles up in the air. Okay, look here. We got spare fuses. You have to have fuses for these cars. Old school. Spare fuses, yes. Napkins, more insurance, registration. Hey, look here. This is, the, this is the orange thing. I don't know, I'm getting there. What else we got? I don't know, just various little hardware of some sort. This car probably came with a flare. Yeah, right? Yeah, a lot of these, it probably has, the, I wonder if it has a safety triangle stuff. So let's see what's here. What is in the orange, dude? It's an old school box, too. Let's see if I can get it open here, hold on. Is it, is it gonna explode? Is it Jack in a Box? Oh, oh, the it's, oh that's factory, that's yeah. original. Oh, because this has the H4 lights in it and everything. You know, the, the yeah. arrow lights. That is too cool. Here's the... Oh, there's our tire pressure right there. Here's the second or third lane from left to oh. keep left onto I-70 East. We're headed to Chick-fil-A. Get some food. I'm hungry, man. I don't know about you, but I'm hungry. Yeah, we gotta get some more go-go juice in our lives. Uh, absolutely. Go-go juice. I'll let Brian concentrate on the traffic here. Yes. yes. In 3.2 have, I haven't opened these boxes yet, but we have sheepskins in the box there, so that is super cool. I can't wait to open those boxes with the sheepskins in it. This because these are the years of the cars like 911s and these. You would you would look inside and it had all the big white sheepskins. Yes, yes, in it. yes, always, always. Yeah. And those things, are, the real sheepskins are super. I think it's like eight nine hundred bucks for a set. You know that, right? What? Yeah. Oh yeah, the real sheepskins, big bucks, big bucks. All our climate control works. Man, and the radio works. And keep your home and business slip free. But uh, yeah, but I, I really think I'm gonna put the original radio back in it, if it works. Yeah. Because right. I love original radios. All right, well, we're gonna go ahead and tend into it here. The driver's door is. No, and the passenger. No. Well, you have the key, I gave you the key. I know, I didn't wanna force uh, it. I didn't wanna. <laughs> how, is the, how is the meal? What? <laughs> <laughs> choke it down, choke it down, Chick-fil-A. So we have no power out of the ashtray. No. And our phones are almost dead. Yeah. And we can't get anywhere no. without direction. No, we're this is pretty sad. We're clueless. So what do we do? <laughs> we have auxiliary power. Between your so legs. So we got the radar plugged in there. I got my cord plugged in there. I got Brian's cord plugged in there. <laughs> so we have power now. And Chick-fil-A. And Chick-fil-A. So Brian's choking, choking his. Uh, never mind. That didn't. That wasn't going very well. <laughs> no, okay. Beep, beep. Okay. Brian's eating his delicious chicken sandwich, yeah. and uh, so then he can drive without deal. And then I'm gonna grab mine, and then get this beast on the road. I don't think ever had Chick Fil A sauce, honey <laughs> mustard on the steering wheel. I don't know. I don't know. But it does now. It, it's going to. All right. Let's. Get this stuff down and go. <laughs> the adventures of Laurel and Hardy. Ready? Yeah. Welcome to Kansas. 
Welcome to Kansas. We have made it to Kansas border. <laughs> we are back from the brink. <laughs> I don't know about that. Kind of a pretty sun, pretty, uh, well, sunset's behind us. <laughs> kind of a pretty glow ahead. Looks pretty flat, doesn't it? Oh, yeah. <laughs> No. God, there's still snow up here, though. Yeah, there is quite a bit of snow. Yeah. Kind of crazy. They must have got more than we did. We are in Kansas. Houston, we may have a problem. <laughs> yes. Uh, our, all of our lights, I don't know if you can get it in the video or not, but they're pulsing. You can, you can kind of tell. Look at our headlights. Is this the German Christine? Yeah. You see they're pulsing, so I think we've got an alternator that's uh uh yeah it, getting it does it at different frequencies so it's kind of slow and then it goes fast. Yeah, I think we got an alternator that's uh going on the fritz. Giving up the ghost. Ooh, hang in there, baby. We can do it. Come on now. Well, you know, I drove through the desert in Texas in that 69 Roadrunner with no lights at 100 mile an hour. <laughs> so we can just turn all the lights off if we need to save power. <laughs> Is it a full moon tonight? <laughs> Brian's like, no. That would be a no. But look at this shifter. It just, it just, boom. <laughs> Brian's like, man, are my eyes messing up or what's up? I did. I didn't. I was like, uh, me well, uh, I hope we don't talk to you guys again until we get home. Yes. <laughs> hey, cross your fingers for us. Well, we're in Salina, Kansas now. Uh, so we're only about an hour and a half from the house. Uh, the car's been a trooper. It's just going down the road, like just so incredibly comfortable and smooth and quiet. It's kind of uncanny, but canny to be honest with you. But uh, yeah, she's just doing good. Uh, hopefully, we've got a little bit of a, a, a fluctuation there with our uh, um, lighting. I'm not quite sure what that is. Maybe like the voltage regulator is kind of uh, oscillating a little bit, but no battery light, so all is well. So Brian's inside there making our last pit stop and uh, gonna get us a slice of pizza to finish this trip out so absolutely it's just been an incredible incredibly rewarding trip with this car I hope you guys uh, are, are enjoying this we're just we've had a lot of fun we're just we're just having fun with it you know and I hope you guys are are enjoying our our banter and our silliness <laughs> I just two guys having fun with cars so appreciate you guys watching along and we'll give you the final little wrap up when we get to the house oh. brian brian we made it we're there we are there it is a high five. Oh my god this that car was an epic adventure that was really epic wasn't it and i mean really no drama i mean considering no. like that was that was pretty um yeah that started out dicey but it got better and you're right. That was a lot of fun. That was pretty optimistic. I mean, that was pretty bold. Let's put it that way. It was. To go get an old Mercedes that we don't know anything about. That had sat in that garage for yes. a long time. It looked time. like, yeah, I know. Long time. Going through all that paperwork and stuff would be kind of interesting. But yeah, this thing got us home. And you know, it was comfortable. It was, and what did it get? Average, what, about 19 About 19, ago? yeah. Not bad. That's not bad. No. But, uh, man, this, this was a neat car. I, it's, man, it's yeah, so it's fun. Absolutely to, so comfortable. I know you already mentioned it, yeah. but I'm telling you, that thing was very comfortable. And what I don't understand is how quiet it was. Right. You it know? Felt, it felt, it did not feel like 1980. No. And what actually was kind of funny here, I want to show people. Uh, one thing me and Brian discovered is this thing has real headrests. Like you could pull them up and then actually tilt them in and literally support the back of your head. You can fall so, asleep driving real quick. I know. It looks like a, it looks like a sofa right there. Just oh. a nice, nice kit. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Exactly. Fantastic well, hello, car. girls. Hello, girls. We got our puppies here. But uh, 
Man, Brian, that was so much fun. Fantastic Dude, trip. I, I am so appreciative of you going along with me on this. I'm not sure hey. what you're thinking about hey, all this deal. Hey, anytime you need somebody to go on along a trip, oh, man. I don't know you. Yeah, you, yeah I don't know you, <laughs> right? Well, man, well, hey, we hope everybody enjoyed this uh, little uh, road trip. Road tripping. But, uh, hey, we, uh, appreciate you following along and, and uh, all that fun, good stuff. But have a great day and happy motoring.